Before we get started with today's video, don't forget about the giveaway. A complete AN 8009 multimeter kit. It's being sponsored by Banggood and it is available to subscribers to this channel anywhere on earth that Banggood delivers. So all you need to do is watch the video for the giveaway down below and comment on it and on September 3rd which is Labor Day here in the United States we will draw the winner and our good friends at Banggood will ship it out to you. Don't forget check the link, enter the contest, good luck to you, big thanks to Banggood. Now to today's video. Hey, what's happening guys? Tonight we are going to talk about another ubiquitous IC. You know, we've talked about the 555 timer 20 or 30 times. It's everywhere. Here's another type of IC you're going to find everywhere. This is the LM317, which is an adjustable voltage regulator. But it can also be an adjustable current regulator, and we'll talk about that too. But let's, uh, let's take a look at this here real quick on this handy little drawing I've made. So you see we've got our three pins, one, two, and three. They are adjust, out, and in. And by setting up this really simple little circuit right here, we can create a nice, stable, adjustable voltage regulator. I'll put a link to the uh, data sheet for this down below so you can look it up, but I'll just hit the high spots. It's good for a uh, low of 1.25 volts, a high of 37 volts, and about 1.5 amp output and it's good up to about 150 degrees C and the line regulation at 5 volts is about 2.5 millivolts and the way this thing works is it has a 1.25 volt um, voltage reference inside of it and by creating this little voltage divider circuit right here we can take advantage of that 1.25 volts and get whatever voltage out we want key to doing that is this formula you see right here. Voltage out equals 1.25 volts times 1 plus R2 over R1. So let's say we have a 12 volt source and we want 9 volts. Well by using that formula we can say 1K over 6.2 K will give us our 9 volts out and I have just such a thing right here we're all set up so here is our LM317 pins 1 2 and 3 remember 3 is our adjust 2 is our out 1 is our in so there's one running up to our VCC there's pin 2 going over to the output did I say that right? Yeah, pin 2 goes to the output, pin 1 is the adjust, pin 3 goes to VCC. There's our 1K, there's our 6.2, and they're set up as a voltage divider. Here's where we can read the output. So let me zoom out here a little bit, so I can bring in a couple more friends. A voltmeter. Whoa, easy there big fella. Oh jeez, gonna have to go up to get him back into circuit, or into camera rather. So you can see here, I got my maximum 11.23 volts. And we'll hook up the meter, always hooking up that ground first, so you don't get any surprises. Okay, we'll turn it on our voltmeter, and we'll turn on our power supply. So you can see we're outputting 11.22 volts and we are getting 9.05 volts. So that is not too bad. We are well within that 25 millivolt standard or 25 millivolt, <laughs> millivolt specification. I'm having trouble talking tonight. Had a little dental incident over the weekend where I bit into a sandwich and lost a tooth. And I got air flying out of places in my mouth that's not supposed to fly out of. but that's neither here nor there 
So this is a really simple circuit. You can see you only need the three components and you can set yourself up a really easy voltage regulator. You can use the formula I showed you or you can use an online calculator and I'll put a link to that down below too. Now we're going to make this a quick video because it's really hot. The thing I said at the beginning was this can also be um, a current limiter and you can hook it up like such. You have our in, we have our out, and we have our adjust. To make this circuit work, it's a variable resistor. If you don't have a variable resistor, you can just use a potentiometer and connect the wiper and one of the outside legs. Really simple. If you guys want me to set that up, we can do that in another video. I think I've wasted enough of your time for tonight. And that being said, I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. Big thanks to all my patrons, and a big thanks to you for watching. That's it. I'm out. Peace.